guys and welcome back to my channel. You may notice a party setup in the background. I have just recorded a video about my party setup so if you haven't already seen that video be sure to check it out on my channel. Today I'm going to talk about my favourite lip sense colours. Now I will say I haven't yet tried all the lip sense colours but I've tried the ones that I think I would like the most and out of those I'm going to share my top five favourite lip sense lip colours and share them with you today. My favourites are in here, some of them that I really didn't like I've already given away because no. So my first favourite is Aussie Rose. Now Aussie Rose looks quite neutral in the bottle but when I wear it, at least on me, it looks very pink and I really like that and I think it's perfect for an everyday look. My second favourite colour is Apple Cider. Now, now Apple Cider was the first lip sense colour I ever tried and I, it made me fall in love with the product so I feel like I can't miss it out. <laughs> Um, I think it's a really gorgeous colour, it's neutral and I don't really like neutrals. I kind of think of this as a nude but a lot of people don't but on me it kind of comes across as a nude. I would just say on this one that it is probably the colour that lasts the least amount of time on me which um, other people say that it lasts the longest but on me it tends to flake away a bit. My third favourite colour is Caramel Apple. Now Caramel Apple is a colour that focus is a colour that I didn't really ever love when I saw it out of the bottle, but someone at one of my parties wanted to try it on, and I had one in stock ready for customers to buy, so I thought, why not open it? I then tried it on this morning, and I am obsessed. Now, most of my other colours that I've tried on are mattes, and that's just because I prefer a matte finish. But this one is a frost and I really like it. I'm quite impressed at how much I like it. So I thought, um, yeah, it's a it's a very natural colour on me. I'll get close and personal, apologise in advance. Um, but I really like it. I'm quite impressed. My fourth favourite colour is Napa. Now... Now Napa is the darkest colour, you may notice that I like so far anyway, um, it's quite natural-ish colours, but Napa is, I just love it on, I think it looks great with like jeans and a nice dark top and I think it will be one of my most used colours in the winter, now I obviously started wearing um, lip scents in the spring and summer, but in the winter this is definitely going to be one of my favourites and it's almost a purpley colour but I'm obsessed with this one. And my final favourite colour, at least at the moment, is a Fly Girl. Now, Fly Girl is probably my brightest colour. Well, actually, maybe Fusia, Fusia is. I do like Fusia too, but I just feel like everyone needs a red lipstick. And the two that we have that are the most popular are Fly Girl and Blue Red. And I think I just prefer, I preferred Fly Girl on paper and I prefer it in real life. So Fly Girl is without a doubt my favourite red colour. So that is my current top five favourite colours. I constantly wear the Aussie Rose, that is my everyday go-to. But I feel like Caramel Apple might be a new favourite. I really like Caramel Apple, so I might, I'm tempted to try some more frosts. So I'll be putting an order in very soon. If you want to order your own colours, please let me know by messaging me on any of my social medias or even leaving a comment below. Now, I am warning you, this might change because we have a lot of amazing colours and I usually, and depending on my mood, I can switch. So be prepared to see another one of my top five favourite lip colours, um, maybe in winter, maybe at the end of the year. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. I'll speak to you next time. Bye. This video is really, we lopsided. I feel like we're lopsided. Apple cider.
rattling that all 